All right, and I believe we are live once again. Welcome back. This is part three of the Pokemon Shield playthrough. Got some food in my stomach, and I'm ready to begin again. You know, it's funny, this was like two hours ago, and I already kind of forgot what we were doing. All right, Nessa, Jim. I'm assuming this is the chairman's secretary. Wait, that's the chair? <laughs> I mean, I guess if he's on vacation or trying to be incognito, that outfit works, but. <laughs> Elena. Oh, she knows him. Interesting. Well, I forgot. She said he endorsed her, so I guess that makes sense. I still find this whole endorsement system interesting. I'll hold a celebration. Okay. No promises, old timer. All right, so let's explore the town just a bit. Very curious what Nessa uses. I haven't really seen many water Pokemon yet, honestly. But then again, I haven't been able to like surf or anything. Shell Bell. It's like a less good version of Leftover, so I'm equipping that. Um. I we had to sell Zapede. <laughs> it's like a flea market area. <laughs> it's interesting. Okay, so this is like a shop shop. Actually, hold up, go back. It doubles any money. I don't remember luck incense being like that. Hmm. Also, pretty penny, though. Oh, this is a straight up repel item. Hmm. Makes the holder blow it in slow moving. It causes attacks to miss its holder. Psychic rock, okay. You know what? Let's invest in the luck instance. Eh, who are we gonna put that on now? Um, you have a held item already. I guess Corvus Squire. I use him often. Oh, magnet. Um, you know what? I'll give that to Toxel because he's part electric. I keep forgetting that. I really want to know what the heck he evolves into. Oh, thank you, Rabbit, for the host. You got a Manchino just in training for my cottony. Uh, if I caught a Manchino, which I haven't yet. Right, can you enter these houses? Yes, you can. Caught me out of a nap. <laughs> How's it going, you say? Not bad at all. Ate some ramen, rested a bit, and now I'm ready to get back to that Pokemon. Want to be fighting Ness so soon, second gym leader. The girl who the internet almost ruined for me, but let's not get into that. I 
I want them to further explain this Dynamaxing phenomenon. Like, I understand, even the people here don't fully understand it, but as a player, it's like, I need to know. Surprising there's nothing in these houses of interest. Full heal. I was talking more like the racism stuff with her. The research is fine. Don't catch too many Pokemon that will deplete the sea life. All those tentacle in the first region say hi, buddy. <laughs> How am I liking the game so far? I'm loving it. Some crazy new Pokemon. I don't know if you've seen it, Rabbit, but I evolved the the Nicket Fox. I think you'll love what it turns into. <laughs> Why did that little whooper just say yo to me? Hmm. Interesting. I just saw Score Bunny's evolution in my rival battle. It's so cool. It has a freaking hoodie. And since you're playing it yourself, I'll just wait for you to see it. It doesn't take too long to evolve, so you'll see it soonish. 2x speeds. It's not in my party at the moment, so unless a like, wild trainer has one, you're not going to see it. Super potion. Okay, not, not the ordinary. I feel like there's no point to this train station now that I can fly. I heard that you can battle on a subway train in the faraway Unova region. Yep. Game Freak went to New York and was like, you know, we could battle on these trains. See, I, for a second, I thought my rival had, um, Grookey, because it was like, Raboot. Oh, like, Raboon? Like, I mean, a Baboon? It's like, oh, wait, no, he has score button. What am I saying? <laughs> Yeah, you get fly before the first gym. <laughs> it's insane. Very curious what this gym's gonna be like after the first one. Oh, hello. Let's see what's here. I swear to God, this is a magic harp or a Goldeen. Whoa! Aracuda? I thought it was gonna be a wishy wash because of the body. It's a Barracuda Pokemon, that's cool. Fury Attack. I like Barracudas as animals, so this is cool to me. They just sound a tape run at first. Oh, that's a millipede. Don't worry about him. He's cool. Oh, I'm not going to say what it is, but there's a Pokemon we found earlier and its evolution that you're probably going to laugh when you see rabbit. <laughs> it's a rock type. Trust me, you'll know it when you see it what I mean. Ooh, I was afraid I was going to kill it. Alright. Get in the ball. Oh, trust me. It's in sword version. Because it's like in um, a mine area. 
Or it's like that's all you see. Like, trust me, either, even if you don't want to see, you're going to see it. Aracuda, pure water. After his eating is filled, his moves become extremely sluggish. That's when Cramorant swallows it up. Okay, so what the hell is a Cramorant? It must be big if it swallows this thing. Uh, let's see your summary. Physical attacker. Yeah, Swift Swim, Aqua Jet, Fury Attack and Bite. Cool. Uh, I'll put you in the PC for now, although I will use you eventually. <laughs> Five Nat Balls. Well, I guess we'll be doing some fishing. Although, you know what? While we're here, let's do a surprise trade. Although, uh, yeah, gotta go online first. Surprise trade. Um, hoot hoot, don't care about you. All right. Next, some fishing up water things. Let's put you in front, line noon. I'm already broken, so I spent all my money on clothes. Not you too, rabbit. Oh god, it's doodle. Choodle, sorry. And bite. Oh, chin chow. I said I was only going to catch Pokemon I truly care about for now on stream. But when it comes to fishing Pokemon, I'm probably going to make an exception. Because if past generations are anything, fishing Pokemon can be annoying to find. Okay, that didn't do much. Thunder Wave using Bastard. I've always liked Chen Chao. It's funny, I didn't uh, know it evolved until after I beat the league. Well, the first league. Well, you we know the first gym leaders and then the league in uh, Gold and Silver. And then I was uh, on the side of the ship going to Kanto. And I fished up a lantern. I was like, holy crap, it's a Pokemon called Lantern. That's, of course, before the time of the internet, really, and it was impossible to be spoiled even if you wanted to be. <laughs> of course, the internet was around, but nothing compared to what it is today. All right, got uh, Chin Chow, cool. Some very interesting things in these waters, so I'm gonna keep on fishing. I thought I should probably use a Paralyzed Heal on my new. I forgot to refill my bottle before I started. It's all good though. I'll do maybe four more encounters just to see what I can find. Hmm. I was not expecting Basilin to be in this game. It's kind of forgettable, honestly. Level 22. As far as I know, Rabbit, I mean not Rabbit, Ragna, there are no rods in this game. Which doesn't bother me at all. I 
All right, time to chuck a Pokeball. I already feel it for you. <laughs> I appreciate that, Aragna. Can we catch this Basculin? Yes, we can. Hello, Raheem. For once, your little octopus gif or uh, emote fits since we're fishing for Pokemon. It would be crazy if we pulled out a freaking Kraken. Ooh, that's what we need, a Kraken Pokemon. The closest we have is Tentacruel. I want like a real Kraken though. Aracuda again. Do you see my host? Oh, I did not see the host. Thank you, Risa. I have to actually up the volume of my new uh, host gif and notification. All right, one more fish encounter, and then I'll go to the gym after I heal. Aracuda. <laughs> There's also an area in the wa first wild area we were at that had um, a bunch of water types like Krabby and stuff. I didn't like catch anything there, though. Two super potions. Hello. Whoa, what are those? The hell is that? Statue of the Pokemon that says they're protected the lighthouse. That's a Sahagan looking Pokemon. Also, we got trade. I swear to God, if you give me a chipmunk. Eh. Sorry, Armorius, but you gotta go. Oh, it's the gym leader. I didn't know she wasn't at the gym. Good thing I came over here. Really? Electroweb is a TM now. Interesting. Nessa's League card. <laughs> Thank you guys for coming through and hosting me. I appreciate it quite a bit. Oh, it's the center over here. No, this way. Let's heal up the team. All right, so be the last uh, trade I do for now, regardless of what I get. Foxy boy. Fogna. <laughs> All right, real quick. I want to see something. Okay, I didn't come over here yet. So this elephant thing was shown in the intro. I don't know his name yet. All right. So once we beat the gym, we can go to the right. Good to know. But I want to see. So I heard there was a wild area around here. 
But how do you get to it? I'm pretty sure all of this is a wild area. I think. Hmm. Well, whatever. Pretty sure it's like unmissable. Although, let me see some real quick. Yeah, so this is a wild area. Oh, it crosses into this one, but I don't think I can like just walk up there. I think. Oh, no, I remember now. So off camera, I was actually walking over there. And the dude was like, oh, this area is full of highly strong Pokemon. You probably can't handle them, but go in if you want. I was like, nah. So I just left. Also, it's time for the debut, I guess, of Toxel. Since he's my electric go-to Pokemon right now. <clears throat> You can learn a track, that's it. Okay. Real quick, let me fill my water bottle. All right, water gym, here we come. Also, let me turn off. Uh... I find that interesting. I didn't know that if, this, if you're on the switch and you use a local connection, it disconnects you from the internet. Are you selling anything new or same old, same old, same old, same old overpriced outfits? <laughs> like I was saying, I'm very curious what Nessa's ace Pokemon is. I haven't seen too many water types. All right, let's go. Second gym time. I shall try. Karis, I shall try. Ooh, this is pretty. Wow. This is like something out of a Mario game. Hey, Konado with the cheers. I mean the bit, sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, so I'm passing the maze block by water. Try pressing that red button over there. Okay, so water. Oh, look, the red button will change the water flow. Interesting. I truly appreciate it, Kanata. I know your username. Just sometimes if when you guys like have different usernames, it's uh, hard to remember each. Especially if you're on like YouTube and Twitch, some of you have different names on each. Temple. All right, talk. So we'll see what you can do. And Kanata with more bits. Thank you. <laughs> I'm happy when you guys are happy with the stream. Or just happy in general. Nuzzle attack. Okay. That really didn't do much. Hmm. 
I might have to rethink this uh, Toxel plan. I mean, he's doing damage, but against like Nessa, I don't know if he can cut it with this. Yeah, save your bits. <laughs> Tempo's face has always kind of creeped me out. No lie. Level 20. Alright, let's continue on. This path is blocked, this path is blocked. What else? Okay, all the paths are blocked, so I had to push this. Then you push this one, which does that. Now, change that back. Let's face this trainer real quick. Um, do I want to keep Toxel in? Hmm. I'll actually put in Corvus Squire first for now. This is Toxel isn't very powerful yet. I have no idea when he evolves either. Krabby. All right, Corvus Squire, pluck him. I'm honestly surprised I didn't do as much. So kill them. Got twenty five. Corefish. I'll stay in. Crabs are also one of my favorite animals, so I've always liked Corefish and um Crabby. I don't like Crawdon for some reason. I also like, um, what's his face? Claude, sir, in his pre evolution. Mr. Big Meaty Claw himself. Lainu wants to learn rest. No. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I was debating on taking a nap, but I said, nah, I really wanted to get back to streaming. Especially since I told you guys I would be gone for no more than like two hours. Hmm, interesting. I guess we'll hit the red one again. That works. Bum, 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 bum. Yes, crabs are also one of my favorite foods, Raheem. But I also just love them as like an animal. <laughs> Probably what her signature Pokemon is, Chudle's Evolution. Oops. Uh, Chudle has some defense, so. I'm not trying to use all my plucks right now. You know what? 
Sand dollar. Lobsters are better, but lobsters are more expensive. <laughs> Seafood is like, in general, my favorite type of food though, so... If you put it in front of me, I'm probably gonna eat it. Crawfish. Shrimp. Crab. Lobster. Squid. Oysters. Doesn't matter, I love it all. Seafood and sweets, that's my go-to in general. Ah, that hurt. Bastard. Don't you do it again. God damn it. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Please don't insult Squirtle and Mud Kip that way. <laughs> uh, I guess Toss will finish it. I might say talk sort of deal with Nessa's first Pokemon, whatever that is. Probably gonna use a revive on Dottle so I can actually get experience for it. It's close to a level up. Hmm. Okay, I can actually get past here already if I push the red one, in theory. What does this one do? I don't think I even need to push this, I think. And then we push the blue, and then in theory we can get out of here. Oh, nope, never mind. I didn't see that. I guess that's what the yellow one's for. And now we're stuck. Couldn't have made it too simple for me, huh? I guess what we're going to do is hit the red first. <laughs> and now we can get up there. All right, I guess I'm going to use a revive. Bring back our boy Dollar. He's a super potion on him. And just to be on the super safe side, heal Corvus Squire. And then we're gonna put Tox on the front. Hey, what's up, Joseph? Are you playing Pokemon as well as not with everyone else, or are you just coming to watch? Gym mission cleared. I normally don't like puzzles like that, but that wasn't bad. As long as it isn't like super annoying, I can manage it. All right, let's get that second gym badge, boys. Our character walks so awkwardly. No type of confidence or finesse. I hope you enjoy it when you do get it. All 
right. Goldine, huh? Let's get it. Have a good day. This might hurt. A lot. Dang it, I was hoping it didn't confuse me. Please don't hit yourself. Uh, okay, gotta switch out Toxel. God damn it. Send in Lion Noon. Nice slash. Give me a crit. This is only using horn attack. Although, even though it hurts. I use Nice Slash just in case you use a potion. Had to be on the safe side. Alright, Goldine is down. Aracuda. Wait, her signature is Aracuda? Wait, or does she have three? Hold up. Okay. Uh, for now, send a dollar. Okay, so yeah, she does have three. All right. Uh, reflect. Uh, I should have known. I wasn't thinking. At least I set the reflect though. Might not be the smartest move, I'm actually gonna keep Dollar in, see how well he can do. Alright, we can eat that now. As long as we don't flinch and actually do some damage. Nice. Damn. Freaking flinch. Hmm. All right, unfortunately, you have to switch now. And if she's just gonna keep spamming bite, perfect person to switch in would be Lightning. Definitely understand, Blake, that I'm loving it so far. Although I feel like you wouldn't be spoiled for what, the, what I've seen so far. Since you haven't been, like, avoiding spoilers. Well, like, unofficial spoilers. Asshole. Nice slash. Alright, and obviously, since we saw in the trailer, her signature Pokemon is going to be Choodle's Evolution. Question is, who do I want to go against that? Dredna. Such a badass name. I think they told us that Dredna was a rock and water type. And if that is the case, Drizzile. Because I can actually use your water moves. Oh god, Nessa, okay. <laughs> Big boy. Now you see why I try to stay spoiler free. Alright, this might be a hassle. So you know what? Guess we're going Dynamax.
Let's go, Drizzile. Flood the stadium. Nessa, there's people in the stadium. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> They really did. A lot of these animations are impressive. Will do, Blake. Although, if you got both versions, I could use the other starters. Ow. Amber's still waiting for her copy to arrive, so she hasn't been able to trade me. That hurt. Yeah, if you had told me Pokemon would be like this back in like 1999, I would not have believed you. And that's all she wrote. Second gym badge is ours. Alright, I forgot to give the other one to your mom. Hope she's enjoying it. Drizzle, the MVP. I feel like they looked at that episode with the tentacle and was like, you know, let's do it. <laughs> Can I patch Pokemon up to level 30? Okay, we're going to the fire gym leader next. Hmm. And TM. Whirlpool! Why do all these TMs suck? Whirlpool, Payday? Like, who asks for this? Unless Whirlpool got a massive buff I don't know about. Fucking huh? 35 power. Why, what would I do with this? No. Enclosure next to sexy. <laughs> well, at least we can head to the uh, next route now. Oh, hello. Oh, I forgot we got to meet with the chairman. Does anyone care about these lead cars? Because I really don't. First, we're going to heal, though. Um, let's take Tox out the front row. Put Sizzle P back there. Hope you sleep well, Raheem. Thank you. <clears throat> you know, I forgot I have a bike now. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I'm sitting here walking. I have a freaking bike. <laughs> that road time will never not be creepy. Jesus. All right, guys, right here. Yeah, I ride my bike indoors. Screw Professor Oak. Are you an Audino or what? I need to know. <laughs> oh, you look like a sassy Audino. <laughs> I feel like 
All the uh, road time in the TV is creepy, but the road time on top of the box is it just makes me feel uncomfortable. <clears throat> Power spot detector. Huh. Was there any point in me coming here? <laughs> oh, slightly better, TM. Heading for Matoske in the fire gym. Wait, Matoske, weren't we there already? He's holed up in Galar Mine number two. Okay, so regardless, we're heading right. Oh, well, it's been fun, Watertown, but I must be on my way. Oh, gather my number two. Oh, hello. Wimpod. I like Wimpod. Krogunk, you're okay. I'm not trying to catch you right now. Couldn't get away, of course. If memory serves, Wimpod, you have to not lower it to yellow, I think. So I think that's when it runs away. Oh, about to find out. And I burned it. <laughs> Uh, let's use a Pokeball. I was thinking Great Ball, but if I don't catch Wimpaw, it's not the end of the world. Oh, god dang. Yep, Wimp out. That's a buzz kill. Oh, a little family of shallows. That's cool. Oh, it's you. That's what I have to say. You again. I do. F I, don't know, I feel sorry for my Pokemon if I made them take part in a battle against low level opponents. I'm not in the mood to deal with weaklings right now. Naturally, let's go. Her and his awesome battle team. <laughs> Spide him. Eye shock. Ah, oh, what the fuck? You bitch.
Asshole. Okay, I want Sizzle P to get experience since he's kind of underleveled, so I'm going to revive him. That Psy Shock, though. Oh, code me. What the heck? But, dude, what the hell? Die. SLOs is at too much damage. And now you're learning Bug Butt. Let's go to Smoke Screen. Ponyta. Uh, fire type. Drizzile. <gasps> it's a Galarian Ponyta! It's so majestic! Look at it! It looks like it's straight out of My Little Pony. Well, I'm guessing you're a Psychic type if that was super effective. Yep. A Psychic Ponyta. My first guess would have been Fairy, of course, since it's a literal unicorn now. But... I actually clicked Sucker Punch on an accident that first time. All right, Cathedra. Um, you no, know we're gonna try Sizzle Pete again. Swear to God, if he dies. Uh, why do you have Rock Tomb? What the heck? Why does a Gothita have Rock Tomb? Who teaches a Gothita Rock Tomb? What type of... <laughs> that annoys me. Stupid ass got the uh, stupid ass rock too. Get wrecked. This thing again. Uh, pretty sure we established it was a uh, fairy type, I think. I need to check the Pokedex for where to find a couple of these things. Oh no, I guess it's psychic. Okay, sorry. Uh, in that case, we just nuzzle you first. Wait, what? Oh, I thought she was like Dynamaxing or something. I should have saw that coming. That's my bad. God dang it. That's Bow's fault. I don't know why I even use Power Trip. It's not that powerful. This thing has a very interesting design. I don't know why I didn't think of her using the potion. I should have called that. This has just not been my battle. My good lord.
Anakin froze. My god, this is not my battle. Jesus. Come on, please hit. Thank you. Ugh, that was rough. You're not weak, just lack talent. <laughs> All right, let me go back and heal. Well, Shuckle, Annoy Bat, and uh, what's the thing's name? Crustle? No, not Crustle. Uh, Barbacle, I think his name is. I need to heal. <sighs> All right, back to the cave. The cave of pain and torment. Wind pods. You know what? Let's try it. <coughs> All right, I've had your part water, because this isn't super effective. Actually, I probably should just use uh, yeah, one of my quick balls. God dang it, I didn't think rap would do that much. Uh, so I get forgetting ahead of myself. Can you just not fish on from the bike? Like I thought it would like get you out the bike by default, but I guess not. Whatever. Shootle. Uh, I'll fish for one more thing before I move on. Go away, Krogunk. Ooh, hello. Something with an aura. And it's just a chewdle. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, construction guy. Put yours out first. Worker Francis and his car coil. It's a very interesting cry. Ooh, that's a double weakness, too. And he's gone. Let's write about dust balls. Oh, what the hell? What? Is that a Galarian stung fisk? What the hell? Oh, 
Out of all the Pokemon, you choose Motherfucking Stungfisk. Stungfisk. I think it's based on a freaking bear trap. Oh, okay, I didn't kill it, thankfully. Oh, yeah, it makes sense. He would be metal or steel, I guess. If you're a bear trap. Steel and ground, probably. Who chose Stungfist from the list of Pokemon that needed evolution? Well, not evolution, it's like a Galarian form. Hey, G Shadow. <laughs> A Galarian Stunfisk. Alright, I'll hit it with one more Swift. I think everyone can agree on that, Karis. Ow. Alright, little bastard. Sizzly Pod and Dollar got level ups. Ground and steel, as I thought. Its conspicuous lips lure prey in as it lies in wait in the mud. When prey gets close, Stunfist clamps his jagged steel fins down on them. It looks evil. <laughs> no. I don't want a Stunfist, even in Galarian form. No one asks for this. <laughs> And it has mimicry? Really? So your type doesn't even matter. Get in the box. They chose freaking Stung Fist to get a Galarian form. Whoa, what the hell? Anyone else see that? The bike's speeding up? How the heck did I do that? <laughs> Looks like my doormat. I'm trying to get the bike to speed... Speed up again. <laughs> I don't know what I just did. I'm circling. B. Tapping B. Okay. Oh. I think tapping B does it. Oh, let me leave. Oh, come on. I can annoy that. Yeah, the game tells you that, Arisa. Can't catch them. Every time you get a badge, it says you can now catch Pokemon up to this level. My current uh, cap right now is 25. Nope, not today, Stunfisk. and roller. Uh, is there a way of stopping you from being OP? Because, like, you can do a lot of exploits to catch those really powerful Pokemon. And then the game would have no challenge, but I feel like the average player wouldn't even attempt that. 
But after uh fail safe. Sending out timber. Confusion. Actually, hold up, gotta check something real quick. I mean, obviously, the game wouldn't allow you to run to something that high level. That was the case. Also, I meant to say 30. That's my limit right now. So just shallows chilling over there. Can't get to it. Rip claw. Oh, Team Yell. Double battle time. Double battle with Team Yell. My new and Thievil. Two very beautiful new Pokemon. You struggle bug. Oh, god damn it. I forgot. Uh. Ow, that hurt too. At least he has double kick. Hmm. I actually sent in my line in. If I don't get this Wooloo out of here. <laughs> hey, he has an emotional attachment to it. Pen missile. Perfect. Why oh, is the last one always a crit? Level ups. Toxel has not learned a single move since I got it. There's something about this thing. I'm just hoping training is worth the effort. Alright, let's get rid of Lightning, because that nice slash is dangerous. Oh, he dodged it? Are you serious? Uh.
Oh, better Wulu than me. Raboot. I love this thing. It almost makes me wish I picked Score Bunny because it looks so cool. It's a bunny with a hoodie. Oh, you know what it reminds me of? The oh, I forgot his name, but um, Summer Wars. If you know what Summer Wars is, you all automatically know what I'm talking about. That's what it reminds me of. That double kick. Well, it was a walking pillow, not a fire. <laughs> oh, you gotta watch Summer Wars. This is a great movie. Really great movie. I'm going to assume Rabu is fighting in fire. It's, like it's the only thing that really makes sense. I gotta say, out of like second forms for starters, period, like across any generation, Rabu is one of my favorites. Like, he looks so freaking awesome. They're almost so polite <laughs> when you beat them. Maybe that's the end joke on uh, how polite people from the UK are. Oh, a Dreadnought. Hello. Wait, did it fully heal me? Oh, it fully healed me. Cool. But, you know what we're going to try to do? We're going to try a quick ball. Come on. One. Two. Three. Hey, we got it. No effort. Not sure which uh, you're referring to with the KSI does exist, Soska. Water rock type. This Pokemon rapidly extends its retractable neck to sink its sharp fangs into distant enemies and take them down. Oops, same to add to the party. Although, we'll see what moves you have. To no one's surprise, it has strong jaw. Oh, English people are being very kind. Ha, huh, you're right. Barbacle, trainer. Goddamn stung fist. Go away. This just makes me angry. Like, why did they choose stung fist? <laughs> yeah. Might as well fish real quick. Core fish! As I said earlier, I like core fish, so we're catching it.
Alright, let's try catching it. I'll toss a normal Pokeball. <clears throat> and Corefish is ours. Three levels. Sent to the box. Steam power can send in any important flying. Uh huh. Rail Staff Vincent. Are you on the clock, sir? You know what, since he wants to dig, I'm gonna switch into Corvus Squire. Doesn't use rock tomb. Onyx, huh? Meet my friend Jalizel. Trizile. I keep wanting to call it Jalizel for some reason. <laughs> I feel like I could kill you with a water gun, but I shall show you my utmost water pulse. At least it didn't have sturdy. TM. Sand Tomb. Still not very useful. Oh, we found him. So he trains against water types. Nice. Sorry, looking for Titus. <laughs> he looked at me like, what? <laughs> Let's go straight once you get out this mine, you'll reach Matoske. Matatos, whatever. Well, we'll see how good he is. All that training is water types is nice, but it ain't gonna help you with the water pulse to the face. Pokey jobs.
pokey jobs, huh? Interesting. Oh, hello. <laughs> Noctowl and pseudo wudo. Coughing. Oops. Actually, didn't mean to run into you. Coughing was a pokey. Coughing and Ekings were two Pokemon I wanted to get regional variants ever since I realized they were a thing in Gen 7. And can't run away. Actually, you know what? I could just kill this thing. Got confusion. I mean, Map has explosion already. You know what's sad when a coughing outspeeds you? Alright, I'm looking for new Pokemon. Oh, thrower here. Pro Gunk. Actually, let me switch you out the front dollar. Cause you have a hard time running from things. Plus you're slow. I like you, but If I wasn't curious as to what it evolves into, I wouldn't have Dollar in the party right now, honestly. Alright. Let's put Corvus Wire in front. Three great balls. Nice. Rock and roller. Whew. I should have took that nap. I'm sure there's at least one new Pokemon in this area, and I'm determined to find it. So it's usually the uh, rule of thumb, Gen 6 onward. Every route has at least one new Pokemon in it. Ooh, amulet coin. I technically already have one with that uh, incense I have on Corvus Squire, but now I have two, technically. Whew. Also, I feel compelled to save. Oops. I can't forget I have a bike. I don't know why. And then I mean around the pseudo widow. It would have been a nice touch if pseudo widow just stays still in the wild instead of walking around. Oops. Didn't mean to challenge you yet, but might as well get it out the way. Madam Caroline. <laughs> and a Yamper. Yeah, let's not do that. Ooh. Oh, come on. Of course I get paralyzed. Alright, it's just gonna spam spark, so I gotta switch out. Oh, this is a crit. Hey, we killed it. 
Respect the sizzly boy. Ooh, bet. Wish I could stay in, but. Alright, Toxel. Hoping Toxel evolves by level 30. Because right now he's just not pulling his weight. <laughs> Which is a shame. Oh, Swoobat. I thought it was Woobat. <laughs> this lady's packing power. Cut that speed down. Damn, still faster than me. I'll take it. Oh, that's confusion. I forgot it's part psychic. Well. Once again, that's Bow's fault. This is the town. There's more than Rog and Rolla in this grass. I know it. You are lying to me, game. Hmm. But first, it might be wise to go ahead and heal in town. Well, you know what? No, I want to go back. Oh crap. I didn't know he was going to turn around. Okay, sir. Calm down. <laughs> a little too excited to see a child at night. This growl is freaking taking it to me. <laughs> Since Gen 2, all you cops use Growlithe. You know, we have more dog Pokemon now. I know for a fact there's more than Crow Gunk and Rog and Rolla in this grass. I don't know if it's gonna be that Galarian Ponyta or what, but there's something in here and I know it. A ball of PP up. Sounds like Viagra. <laughs> uh, I'm stupid. <laughs> Definitely a fake cough. <laughs> Alright, I'll give this a few minutes, and if I don't run into anything, then screw it. Anything besides these two. Anticipation. Chew it'll go away. Huh? 
It's currently 7.37 on my end. If it hits 7.40 and I don't find anything interesting, I am out. Three minutes. <clears throat> Probably closer to two, actually. Thank you, coffee. I didn't even know Fallen Order came out today. Wait, whoa, whoa, what the heck? Yes, I told you. I knew it. Hatena, we found one. I didn't know um, Fallen Order even came out today until someone mentioned it to me. I knew there was something in this grass. This goes to show you, I once again did not even know about it. I literally see one person on my time, I even talk about it. Life do. You little asshole. Curious if there's any, sh uh, I almost said shiny catching, but shiny finding methods in this game. <clears throat> oh, is that a critical capture? It was a critical capture, my first one. Cool. I was wondering if those were still in the game or not. No, you can't learn a scary face. Learn something useful. Pure Psychic, the Calm Pokemon. If this Pokemon senses a strong emotion, it will run away as fast as it can. It prefers areas without people. Huh. A Pokemon I can relate to. I'm very curious what you evolve into. Because, like, you look like a deformed thing without a body. That should remind me of a Yu-Gi-Oh card. That's, like, one of the first Yu-Gi-Oh cards as a clown. Life do, huh? Hmm. Send to box for now. All right, I'm good. Let's go. Pretty feather. I feel like electricity coming out of your bike isn't a safe thing for children, but what do I know? When I was a kid, they uh, advertised heel not Heelys, those um scooters where you could like mash down the back and sparks would come out. <laughs> Are we in the town? Retain the Pokeball. The ball guy so creeps me out. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, this is the end. Oh, I didn't mean to come in here yet. Her little Pikachu clone is very interesting. Uh, not yet. Apparently we gotta battle her, and I ain't ready for that yet, cause my team needs to be healed. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot. We were already here. I forgot where uh, we made a circle, basically. Back to uh, Matoske. I forgot this is the city we've been to already. I probably didn't recognize it because we're at night now. Um, center was here. Around the corner, I believe. Yeah. <clears> hmm. <throat> Hey, yo, sis. How am I finding the game? I am enjoying it greatly. Very worth the wait of staying spoiler free for over half a freaking year. Sweet, sweet payoff. All right, so let's go challenge what's her face. I have no idea what typing this Pikachu clone of hers would be besides electric, of course. Uh, I'll start with Line Noon, actually. Also, I don't even know if she even has other Pokemon. Hmm. Oh, right, 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 I forgot. Can't go to the gym yet. Silly moi. Alright. Curious if she has a unique battle theme. <laughs> I like how they're in the battle with her. <laughs> Alright, she has a crow gunk. And yeah, she does have a unique theme, unsurprisingly. Yeah, I forgot. Crow going fighting type. That's a bad thing. Ooh. Hmm. And now you get O code. More Pico. I'm assuming that's her Pikachu clone. All right, Sizzly Paw. Well, Sizzly Pete, I believe in you. More Pico. Nice to meet you, finally. Wait, you can't buy me back. Ow. What? Are you a dark type? What? What the heck? Uh, okay, that just happened. This thing is very angry now. <laughs> well, if you're a dark type, I'll just send in Drizzle. I wonder what the heck just happened to this thing. What the fuck? In Gemini Pokemon? Pokemon is a Scraggy. We can deal with a Scraggy easily. Hmm. 
Her theme's not bad, but I prefer uh, BD's theme. See, I was wondering if there's gonna be some twist with her to like where she's actually evil, but seeing her now, I kind of doubt it. Even though her signature Pokemon is kind of like that, so I wasn't too far off base, I guess. Everyone has a super potion. I just beat the second gym, going after the third now. All right, we beat Marnie. I don't trust you more, Pico. Next morning. Tomb burn heals. <laughs> Thankfully for me, I chose the water starter to start out with. So I'm pretty confident going into this. Even then, I believe in this team. Let me guess, Hop has this already. Of course. Alright, third gym, here we come. Let's see what's so difficult about the fire, Jim. I might actually use the fire outfit once I beat him, since it's not bad looking. You look creepy. We're catching Pokemon? Huh. Interesting. Hey, it's my buddy, Sizzlypede. Oh, he's still landed. So you either knock it out or catch it, huh? Well, since this, uh, this is a contest of speed to a degree, probably going to keep out Drizzle. Wait, really? So the Salandic can attack me too? Okay, dick. Dude, that's the way you want to play. Screw you. I'll knock the Pokemon out first before you can touch it. So with that being said, let me put you in first. Ooh, is that a Litwick?
Lit wiki. My first lit wick is named wiki with it. <laughs> I want to catch you lit wick, but I'm trying to win them points. <laughs> and Vulpix. Not of the Alolan variety, unfortunately. Roly coly, keep on rolling. Checking Twitter. Oh, it's five points. See, I thought I was just gonna end once I beat all of them. But sure. I guess I can try catching Ludwig if I don't knock it out in one hit. But you know what? To be on the safe side, I'm gonna get rid of you. Wait, you have more than one Pokemon? Hmm. That makes this much more annoying. Alright, well, I use my weaker moves, see if you will survive. At this rate, we'll see Drizzle evolve tomorrow. Also, I might as well just kill the next thing I see. Fake out bastard. I guess he didn't hit me. So is that the entire mission? I thought that was just like step one. Okay, well we can face Kabu now. Guess we'll heal up. That's what people have so much trouble with. That Gala region disappoints me. Uh sort this. I type. Um, to start this off, I will be bringing Cold Squire up first. Alright, fire gym time. Let's do this. I still say the uniforms are freaking pointless. It's a cool arena, I'll give them that. Get it. Nine tails. Okay. Hmm. Let's 
see how much plug does first. Will o Wisp, huh? In that case, I'm switching out ASAP. Yeah. I was going to save uh, Sizzle for whatever. Not, yeah, Sizz Drizzle, sorry. For whatever his ace was, but he forced my hand with a freaking nine tails off the bat. We can take that. Of course, we get burned. Motherfucker. Water pulsum. Survive that, huh? In case he uses a potion. This nine tails is racking up the damage. Of course, now I get the crit. You guys see how bad my luck is? You want to learn coil, huh? Attack, defense, and accuracy, huh? Oh, might as well get rid of rap. Can burn. Ugh, man, he's a freaking Arcanine of all things. This is gonna get messy. Intimidate. Well, in that case, let me take this time to heal Drizzle. Wish I had a full restore. Let me pull out the super potion. Intimidate and burn. Asshole. Alright, switching out. Very funny. Ain't no one rewatching no trash victory Gundam. I was afraid he was using bite. Don't make me flinch. God damn it. Ugh. I'm having terrible luck on stream tonight. All these status effects, and I'm getting flinched. Motherfucker! Sucker punch. Shoot, tired crap. Take down. Nah. All right, what's your ace? Sent to scorch. 
Okay, that's the evolution of Sizzlepede. I have not seen this yet. Um, I guess we'll be sending in Lionu. Half my team is burned, man. What the heck? All right, let's see what this thing evolves into. Santa Scorch. Let's go. Oh boy. Whoa! It has the fire symbol on his face. That's cool. I like it. I like it a lot. I almost forgot. I got a freaking heal. I had no choice. Of course. It looks like a freaking Komodo dragon. G Max Center. What the fuck? I thought they removed Z moves from the game. Jesus. You're Dynamax, and so are we. Max. Kaiser Beautiful It started to rain Max flutter by Ow Of course I lower my special attack of all things Thankfully, the rain should negate that, though. And that's all she wrote. <laughs> he knows the water power, guys. <laughs> U-turn? Really? You have a very interesting move set. I guess just for type coverage, I'll t get rid of water gun. I'm gonna take Titus out real quick after these events. Oh, you already know the anime is gonna use this. Now we are victorious. Yeah, we got the fire badge. That was the most challenging gym battle yet, I'll give it that. Will o' Wisp. <laughs> Is anyone ever truly safe from Victory Gundam?
Head down to the wild air starting to say then make your way to Hammerlock. I'm guessing that's past that bridge. Hmm. I wonder what level Sizzle Sizzly Pete evolves in, because mine's twenty five and his is twenty nine and already evolved. Anyways, I'll be back. No, sorry, go on, take that. It's
Okay, and we are back. Thank you guys for the wait. So, just beat the fire gym. And we have to go back to the wild area and pass that bridge I saw before. Oh, all three of them are seeing us off. Interesting. <laughs> Onward to Hammerlock. Well, at least they put us right here. And this asshole. <laughs> well, these two are off to battle. Wait, him? Okay, is Beady a boy or a girl? Because I could have sworn they said she. And this whole time I've been assuming it's a girl, but he just said he or him, whatever. Found a revive. Alright. And that bridge over there is our destination. Is that freaking tr uh, trash is walking around like it owns the place? As always, if I see something that catches my eye, I'll catch it, but... Growlithe. Stunky. I know what the heck that was for a second. Did I say the sunlight is harsh or the sandstorm? This doesn't look like no sunlight. A victory Gundam Pokemon. The sunlight is harsh. What? <laughs> is how sunlight looks in the UK? <laughs> Alright, I'm getting out of this area. I realize very soon that these uh, wild areas, their only purpose is to not overload the routes with other Pokemon. <laughs> Which I ain't gonna judge him for. Snorlax. Drapion. I have not been over here yet, so probably gonna be seeing a lot of new things. Skaroopy. Yamper. Oh, hello, Sigilyph. Firestone. Big Mushroom. Also, his frame rate is taking a bit of a hit. Per line.
Uh, why is there electricity on the battlefield? That's new. Never had thunder effects. I feel like it's not safe for us to have an electric bike. Oh, it's a Corviknight. I'm not going to try and catch it because I already have my own. Uh, I just want to talk to the Whelmer. <laughs> Actually, you know, let's get off the bike real quick. Curious if there's anything new in the water. Another Aracuda. Now let your currents run across the battlefield. Run for cover. That was my fault. Great ball. <laughs> Barascuda? Okay. I'm assuming these are like, uh, kind of like Basculine and not an evolution. Arascuda and Barascuda. One second. Had to do something off camera. Just got an email. Trust that, but we'll see. Okay, let's try and catch this thing. I'm guessing this is that thing I saw in the beginning of the game that looked like a propeller in the water. Alright, it's time to, look, time to start chucking balls. Well, this thing looks like it has one of those curly uh, mustaches. <laughs> kind of miss the Emperor at times like this. Saying the ball, Barracuda. And we got it. Pure Waters, Skewer Pokemon. It spins its tail fins to propel itself, surging forward at speeds of over 100 knots before ramming prey and spearing into them. Swift Swim as well. Hmm, you have Dive. I'll send you to the box. All gather Poke Team indeed. I was not expecting to find one of those. I kind of doubt we'll find anything else new, but might as well check. Just once. Aracuda. Oh, there are no Toxos in front. Hopefully he can run. 
go. Let's put lining in front. Oh, it's zooming out. Tanks that frame rate. Good lord. Pokeball. Yeah, so Yamper. All right. Uh, let's make our way. Garbodor. Really, they added Maractus to this game? You add Maractus? Out of all the Pokemon that could be cut. Palpitoad. I actually like Salzmi Toad, but I don't like either of his pre evolutions. I think I hear a Golden Stone Tula. <laughs> Wrong series. There's a cutie fly. Yeah, expect me to get into a lot of encounters in this grass. <laughs> Clay doll. Pretty W. Noibats. Oh, you! You, come here! What is your name? Q Fant. All right, you're coming with me, Q Fant. Ow! That was just a rock smash. West Town HD is ready with a party of three. Hello, Gloss Garden, and anyone coming from Blake's stream. How are you tonight? Uh, let's send in. Uh, trying to think who can survive against this thing while I try to catch it. I had to restart my computer at the end of the fire gym. Did I miss anything? Uh, did you see his, like, signature Pokemon? Sorry than that, no. Oh, critical capture? Hey, nice. We got a Q fan. My team is hurting right now. <laughs> Very badly. Oh, you're a steel type. I thought you were like ground. The Copperdom Pokemon. If a job requires serious strength, this Pokemon will excel at it. Its copper body tarnishes in the rain, turning a vibrant green color. Hmm. I was not expecting you to be a steel type. Sheer force. Rock smash bull dull stump iron defense. Uh send you to the box. Yeah, right when you did a Z like move. Yeah, you didn't miss anything after that. Making our way to the next city. My team's hurting a bit at the moment, so I'm trying to get through here. Uh, who to put in front? Guess I'll put you in front. Hope everyone's having a good day. I certainly am, even though my throat's starting to kill me from talking all day. You know, I don't like tea. I might make myself some tea help my throat, because... I'm gonna be playing this entire game on stream. Ooh, Waterstone. I need to look over to find that freaking Galarian Ponyta. I want it. Very badly. I could just open the Pokedex, but too lazy. Hmm. 
Hello. I see a house over there. Let us go explore. Oh, guys, beware. Caliper. That's a lot of Pokemon. I shot that I avoided them all. Oh, are you guys selling stuff? The digging duo. Hmm. Dig us on treasure, huh? Sure. Dig me us on treasure, slave. When you get the bike. Uh not very far into the game. I think that was after my... No, I think it was after the first gym. Maybe the second. It's not very far in. Star piece, sure. Leaf stone. Shiny stone. Everstone. Bag of stardust. More stardust. Hard stone, Jesus. Stardust. Star piece. Leaf stone. Icy rock. Rare bone. <laughs> Jesus. Water stone. Is he gonna stop? <laughs> All of that. This man dug up 16 things. Okay, after the second gym, Risei says. I'm seeing something. Yep, I have a ton of stones and crap. Alright. Oh yeah, let's talk to the other brother real quick. Is there a difference between you two? Sure. I'm curious if there's a difference between the two. You dug up one thing, you lazy mo- okay. Okay. 50W. Oh, it looks like this place is close. The Rotom Rally. Sure. Well, we have a water bicycle uniform now. Ooh, Mega Horn. Flash Cannon, Throat Chop, and Outrage. Hello. Improve my bike. You can upgrade your bike for a thousand watts. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, there's two uh, nurseries in the game. Well, in that case, let's leave. Atena and uh, mm, Meowth. So I need to collect some points real quick because I want to upgrade my bike. How long it take to get the Master Ball? Couldn't tell you. Alright, I need glowing points. There's one. Oh, is that Salandit? Yeah, that's a Salandit. <laughs> so... In theory, it would take three of these. Yep, I need two more to upgrade my bike. 
I wonder if these things respawn. If so, what's the rate? One more. And there he is. Freaking go lurks just walking around. What the hell? I might as well get the other one. Yeah, of course. He says he's going to increase the turbo mode of my bike. And I'm really curious just how fast it's about to be. Hmm. <clears throat> Alright. Nope. Don't want to do that. Improve my bike. Yes. Your bike has extra power. Since your turbo changed fast now, why not have another go at the Roll Tom Rally? Well, haven't seen a difference just yet, but... Alright, now let's make our way to the town. Pokemon. The one time I want to zoom out the camera, the game won't let me. Okay, it's over here, I think. Whoa, Feral Thorn. Kind of forgot Feral Thorn was the thing. So many items. Revive, Pokeball, and another. I think we've been streaming for a total of almost seven hours today. It's pretty cool. Open my whoops. Open up the map real quick. Okay, so we are going the right way, sort of. Yeah, because we're past the bridge. Hey, it's the evolution of what's his face. Little fat squirrel. It's kind of cute in its own way. Do 20. For those of you just coming in, I'm jotting down the time I see every Pokemon. So I can make a compilation video of me reacting to every single new Pokemon. Honestly, why does this place look kind of intimidating? Oh, Amber got the game finally. This Pokemon is so effing cute. Only just made it to the steampunk town. Hubby's turn to play now. <laughs> Hey, G Shadow. I can see clearly. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> hmm. 
Dredna. Lava Fit. Oh, that's a Minchino. I was wondering what the heck that was. I don't think I've seen any Dynamax spots, which is interesting. For those of you playing the game, how do you feel about the Dynamax uh, feature? Or I guess even if you're not playing the game, and you just like watching people play. Oh, Mantike. Gloom. Shootle. Can't tell what that is. Whooper? Yeah, it's a whooper. Joe Tick. I've been looking for one of these. I love me some Galvantula. Let's hit you with that swift. It can probably survive another one, but I'm not going to risk it. Instead, I will use U-Turn. Ah, oh, hit me with Thunder Wave. Perfect spot for catching. Um, I guess I'll send in Dollar. And great ball. Hey, can stay in the ball, Joltik. It's nice and comfy in the ball. Okay. All right, we got Jotik. Ooh, that frame rate. <laughs> Rain and a bunch of Pokemon on screen at once. Not good. Inke. So, so far we've seen Galarian forms with Zigzagoon, Ponyta, Meowth, Stungfisk. I th Is that freaking Gorgas? I think that's it. I think. I might be forgetting like one. And of course, the exact game is Evolution Lightning, but I want to see what that um, Galarian Persian looks like. Clang, Tranquil. Oh my God, it's a Lightning! <laughs> it's running around like crazy. All right. Uh, we're here, but how do we get in? Or is this the wrong side? <laughs> okay, gotta go through the dragon's mouth. Oh god, it's wild foot. Second. All right. Uh, guessing we can't run from you. Freaking Wobbuffet. Can you use U-turn though. Huh? 
Uh, I guess we'll use Sizzlypede. It would be some real crap if we got rolled out by a freaking Wobbuffet. Oh no. Ah, oh, you bastard. Part of me wants revenge, but the other part of me says nope. Because if I die to a Wobbuffet and I have to go through all this again, nope. Uh huh. Random seller of oh, crap. Uh, let's check around here real quick. Is that a Roserade? It's a freaking Roserade. Oh god, it's Corviknight. <laughs> Alright, it's just entered the town already. Ah, so we actually beat Hop. Color me shocked, actually. This place looks like a freaking imperial fortress. It's a literal fortress. <laughs> hmm. Let's heal first of all, because we are hurting right now very badly. Oh, BP seller. Hmm. So you can buy rare candies, EV items, evolution items, and these. Cool. Huh. A hey, dust balls. That's what the doctor ordered. Let's buy 30 of those. Then we're gonna buy 10 timer balls. Actually, no, let's buy 20 of those. Just because we can, let's buy 5 die balls. And then we're gonna make some money back real quick with all this crap we have to sell. Uh, maybe under other items. Or no. Not medicine. Not battle. Oh, treasures. Okay, it has its own thing. And watch our money go right back up. Ballin'. Ah, he sells repels now. Although I don't mess with repels. All right. Uh, I don't think we even talked to Nestroy yet. I think. Oh. 
Oh yeah, I haven't done this yet. Let's check out what pokey jobs are. Oh, we can also try the lotto ID here. That's cool. Oh, really? I actually got a match. Oh, just one though. Freaking Moo Moo Milk. I thought it was like three letters, I mean numbers or something. That's fine though. Um, Pokey Jobs. What are Pokey Jobs? Okay, they gave experience. Hmm. Take this job. Must be good with fire. Uh, I don't know if I have Pokemon good with fire. Besides my Sizzlypede and Growlithe. Sure, I select Growlithe. Oh yeah, I have Karkul in its pre-evolution, I guess. I guess even if you're not good with fire, I can pick you though. Like, um, like Joltik. Oh, I need one more. Okay, I thought I could just choose up to five, but send Pokemon. Whole day. I hope that's not like a whole day in like real time, because Jesus Christ. I think it's real daytime. <laughs> uh, grass Pokemon, bug types, and normal types. Wait, hold up. Nah, I'll just do this one for now. 24 freaking hours, though. That better be a ton of experience to come back with. Um, I think we're done in here. Alright, let's go talking to people around town. Sure. Oh, okay. We're battling a dude in his house. That's okay. <laughs> and let's make a U turn. Oh, it's level two. If I known that, I would have killed it. Something else. Guessing is giving us a focus sash once we beat him, though. His asshole used Endeavor on me. Asshole with a capital A. Everyone got one or two experience points. And we got a focus sash. I'm glad it tells you now that the item will disappear once it's used. Because focus sash is good for online, but if you use it offline, yeah. <laughs> kind of got to get another one.
Okay, so see what clothes they have. Hmm, kind of like these. I don't know about the price. I gotta go for that uh, tracksuit jacket. I'm not feeling the track pants though. I want like black jeans with this, but whatever. You know what? Why not? When in Rome, right? Equip. <laughs> Should we go full on hipster? I think this will do for now. <laughs> Some fresh threads, and we're all on our way. I want one of these things. It's very adorable. Oh, it's a battle cafe. I will battle here in a second. Hold up. Make sure who's up first. Actually, let's put Line Noon first. Just in case there's a double battle, we'll put you in second. I miss my triple battles. I'm just trying to find the owner. <laughs> okay. Okay, there's a- whoa, whoa, what is that? It's a Pokemon made out of, uh, something? Al creamy? I want to eat it. It's adorable, but I want to eat it. I like it a lot. <laughs> Whoa, 37, holy crap, hold up. He's, I'm assuming you're both fairy types. Well, I know Slurpuff is, but. Uh. Hmm. All right. Realistically, by noon, you can't do anything. Although, I hope he doesn't get jumped on, because I kind of want the Pokemon coming out to be fine. I guess I'll go after all creamy first. Uh oh. Ooh, that hurt. Well, so much for that. Gee, that was a crit? Ugh. Alright, let's bring in Drizzile.
Mm. I could get lucky and win this, but the fact that I don't have anyone with the move strong against fairies right now is really hurting me. I could get lucky. Like that with a crit. Now pluck him for all he's worth. Come on, come on, come on. Not enough. Ah, uh, that hurts. I'm challenging him to a rematch. Hmm. Now I know what to expect. Alright, headbutt, pluck. Can at least take out the all creamy. That experience. Now let's hope we can actually win. Oh no. Oh no. Freaking play rough. Well, once again, we could get lucky with Nuzzle. Now paralyze him. Could get lucky that way. Alright, paralyze. Perfect. Oh, I forgot. I have. He has acid. I forgot because I don't use him much for battles. This is just weak. And still not going to do much, but still. Well. If Toxel somehow pulls this off. If he pulls this off somehow. Nope. Paralysis did not work. Dang. So close. I know what to do now, though. We're good. <sighs> First time losing. Then again, the team was almost 10 levels above me. Okay, so we're going to need Toxel for Nuzzle, and then Corvus Squire, you have the best chance of dealing damage without dying. It's time for a rematch. Ready for you this time, Bernard. Alright, nuzzle, pluck. Nice, just what I need. Come on. Oh, come on, man. Uh. Assholes. <sighs> well, let's try this. 
I have a couple ways I could go about this, but still. Of course it has a tract. Of course. Don't you dare. Mother f This is going worse than the first time. Did enough. All right, all creamies down. That damn play rough. Okay. Chances of victory are still there. Water pulse. And then uh, headbutt. At least we go first. And thankfully, it's probably gonna take out Line Noon, so I can get another wall. Uh, water. Yes, it flinch. Screw you. Take this to the face. Take it. Take it. Not enough for the kill, but that is okay. Drizal, you did your job. Ooh, take a good rest. Can't kill us both in one hit. Okay. Somehow won that. Level 27 for Sizzlypede. That's sad shit, huh? That was rough. One of these ponyta. Look at it. It's glorious. You can do hair and makeup in this game, huh? Hey, how they make you pay up front. No, me. I gotta go with the braids. To get pink braids. Can be like six seconds and go red. <laughs> but now nah, we'll go black. Mm 
Looking clean. I'll leave the hat off. Can't wait to see what Galarian Rapidash looks like. Super Repel. Two Hyper Potions. <laughs> no one can wear it because the cave's too heavy. Ah, another Pokemon Center over here. All right, TMs. There's always nothing I care about. I guess Brian isn't bad, though. Yeah, I'll buy Brian. Could teach it to Drizzle, but not right now. One second. Sorry, I was thinking about something. Oh, two are having a battle. You know what this looks like? It looks like the um, outside park arena from Pokemon Stadium 2. Great memories for me. If you got a talk, so would you play it? Please trade for my Togepi. Why would I trade you that? I have to post that to Twitter. <laughs> I gotta post that one. Whew. There's a chance that I will stop streaming tonight, but I might like record still to like get anything on camera. Wait, this is the gym? Oh, the vault. If you give the if you give the one you like an app, and you, man, I thought you were gonna tell me something useful. Get out of here. If I had another app, then I'd give it to you. I used to pledge moves. Yep, water pledge. It's more powerful than water pulse, but it only has 10 PP. 
For now, I'll actually get rid of Swift. Just because I can reteach it anytime I need to. Alright, let's go back to what we're supposed to do. I don't trust his ex uh, assistant. <sighs> so these uh, meteorite stone things do more than give us Dynamax, huh? I'm good. Uh, no. Hey, got a suit bell. Hmm. I think every city in this game feels like an actual city. Like, it's, they're big. This way yet. <laughs> As always, you don't sell anything unique. I don't even know why I check at this point. Strawberry sweet. When a millstory holds this, it'll spin around happily. Wait, does millstory evolve into that thing I saw? Hold up. If they're next to each other in the Pokedex, then that confirms it. Nope. At least not there. Okay, that was weird. But yeah, they're next to each other, so you do turn to that. Where do you f find this thing? Hmm. Can be found here, huh? I'm tempted to go find one, but it's not like a necessity. Actually, while I'm here, where's that ponyta? I might catch another apple for that dude just to see what happens, but we'll see.
I'll talk so when will you become more useful? All right, Ponyta. Habitats. Oh, I can't find one yet. It's good to know I haven't missed it, but it'll be wherever the heck this is. It's very specific, actually. You can't find it anywhere else. Interesting. Good to know. Ooh, rare candy. Tempted to use it on talk, so just to speed along his hopeful evolution. And you know what? I'm gonna do it. I might even use some of those uh, rare candies. Not rare candies, the uh... What was the other thing called? EXP candies, there you go. Evolution, not either yet. I'm determined to get this thing to evolve. <laughs> and if it ain't level 30, I'm tempted to almost look it up. Okay, can I go in here? Deliver a love letter. Mm-hmm. Frank and Balon Balonly? Pair of wise glasses. All right, I think we've explored everywhere there is to explore here. Dire hits. So let's head up now. Just double checking something real quick. I feel like the only reason I would willingly fight Dynamax battles in the wild area is to um, just get TRs. Head towards Route 6 from the stadium, you should find a vault without any issues. Some Pokemon here too? Jeez. Same uniform, same uniforms. You still scare me, ball man. Oof. Also, I've been wondering, is that a costume with his skin or is he just that pale? Is the helmet cutting off circulation? Like, I have questions. Questions we'll probably never get the answer to. Oh, 
All right, he said head to Route 6, and that's to the right, or... No, to the left. To the left, to the left. All the Pokemon we want are to the left. Oh, Leon. Everyone heist up this Raihan, dude. Are you here before? Wow, you really had to look up our name when we're right here. Ugh. All right, what is in this vault? Besides trophies. <laughs> Let's see something real quick, guys. Okay, just had to make sure of something. All right, let's continue. Ooh, TM. Why are you giving me these useless TMs? Also, I just realized something. Hold up. Sorry. Something just occurred to me. Actually, I don't know if I can do it right now. I don't know where to find out, I guess. Can I do this while I'm streaming? Edit. Oh, oh, I can. Hold up. Gotta do something silly, silly sh bow. Completely forgot to do something for YouTube.
think that'll do it. Okay. We should be set. All right, sorry about that. Well, this is not why I was expecting to find inside the vault. A wife who in paintings. Quite a simple backstory. <laughs> to revise. It'd be cool if um, one of the heroes turned out to be like a dark hero or whatever. All right, guess we're done here. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about his design, if I'm being honest. Go conquer Route 6 and train yourself up all along the way to Stow on Side. Is that really the name of the town? Stow on Side? <laughs> well, new route, new Pokemon. Let's do it. Uh, what the hell is that? Silicobra? I kind of like it, although it looks kind of sad and beat up. These guys are so weird. They're not a villainous team. <laughs> They're just annoying with their cheering. Uh, let's take out the trash. I gotta give it to Team Yell. They might be the most uh, unique antagonist team we've had in the series so far. Swap you out, Dollar. Um, no, let's just go into Drizzle. I did a lot. Haha, <laughs> you're confused. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Of course it didn't hit itself and it poisoned me. God dang it. Just my luck.
I'm assuming he tried to use Sucker Punch since it went first. Think about taking Lineoon out the party soonish. Also, speak of the devil. Um. Let's try again, Sizzle Pete. Yep, just waste your turn. You get the bug bites. Uh oh, that's gonna hurt. E. <sighs> Maybe it's because I'm not catching a lot of Pokemon. In fact, I'm getting messed up a lot. <laughs> I'm just gonna go back and heal since two people are poisoned and others knocked out. Ow. Oh, second battle. Okay, I thought he was battling the other grunt. Lovely. Let me guess, five times. Three, and four, and five, of course. <laughs> Time to test out Water Pledge. That hurt. Hmm. Well, I did the job. So, is anyone just going to ignore the Cobra? Cobra's like, whatever. <laughs> I'm out. I'm guessing you're the next gym leader. She's literally the queen. <laughs> All right, let's heal real quick. I 
feel like we haven't saved in a long time, so let's change that. Wait, we've been playing for 20 hours? Ain't no way. Okay, 10 hours. I was confused. I was about to say. Say, so ain't no way in hell. Yeah, I think I'm going to switch up the party soon. First, we're going to see what's on this route. Trainer. Beauty Anita. Hey, flying Kafaris, they can take a hit. You really got a move you can learn naturally. Fury swipes. He's only hit three times. My luck today has been the opposite. You can hit five times. You can hit with status effects at every opportunity. Shout out to you guys still sticking with me. I know the day has like waned on. Everyone might be low on energy. <laughs> Still enjoying myself though. Ooh, cafe bowl. Hmm. Yeah, you're a poison type. I'm not poison, I'm a fairy type now. Hmm. Yes, I'll send in Cobra Squire. If I dislike fighting Clefairy, I dislike fighting Clefable even more. Defensive bastard. Ha! She got splash! Ha 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 ha. Use metronome and get splash. I thought my luck was bad. Wing attack, huh? I find that offensive. Really toxic. Pluck him good, Cola Squire. Like I said, hate fighting Clefables. Finally, please become useful. Please, yo, Toxtricity is a punk rocker. That sick. We finally evolved it. Hoof. Toxtricity. Electric and poison. Amped form? It has different forms? The short tempered and aggressive Pokemon chugs stagnant water to absorb any toxins it might contain. It chugs stagnant water. What? 
Want to learn a spark? Sure. I'm not getting rid of Nuzzle though, because it's useful. He finally evolved, ladies and gentlemen. Can I attract? Scary face. My swift and payback. Hmm. Nothing too useful. Then again, I don't have many good TMs. Punk Rock. Boosts the power of sound based moves. The Pokemon also takes half the damage from these kinds of moves. Interesting. Adamant Nature. And apparently, he has different forms. Although, obviously, I have no idea how to get the other form or forms. Might as well give you payback. We have a Toxtricity. I almost forgot I need to heal uh, Cora Squire of his poison. Oh, Dusko. I've always liked Dusko. Diglett, Yamask. Three Ultra Balls. Helioptile. Curious what the rare encounter over here is going to be. Doug Trio. Please don't have arena, whatever. Damn, arena trap. Probably going to die now. Uh <sighs> This is not going to be pretty. At least he can take a hit now. And dish it back out. That nice experience too. Hey, finally. You already know what you're turning into, but still, you're evolving. Scorch is ours. While his burning body is already dangerous on its own, the successively hostile Pokemon also has large and very sharp fangs. <laughs> Already starting to look better. Although I might switch out Santa Scorch with Line Noon soon. We'll see. His speed is trash. He has surprisingly good special defense, but low regular defense. Ooh, a double battle. Which sounds like the perfect time to test out our two new members. Bish Sharp and Togetic. <clears throat> Luckily for me, I have type advantages over both. Hit bent. Flip. 
flame wheel. And it was a crit. I will say I like um, Santi Scorch's first form a tiny bit better, but I do like him. I hope in Dotler I've also had 30 as well. So I'm dying to see what he turns into. I'm trying to see what the uh, route exclusive is here first before I change out the party. Also, moving around the bike can be a bit uh, clunky when you're trying to like be precise with your movements. Hmm, maybe I should just continue on. So the grass anyways. Might as well see what this fishing in the water. Magic art. Alright, let's continue on. Hey, I found it! Silly Cobra. And you know what? I think I'll add you to the party. If I can catch you. Hmm? Are you a ground type? Because Nuzzle does not affect you. Interesting. Uh... Yep, it's a ground type. Ow, that hurt. Pretty sure I can survive a fury attack. Yeah, that'll be fine. Alright, time to start chucking balls. And a three. And welcome to the party. Alright, Lion Noon, I'm gonna swap you out at least for a bit. Pure ground, sand snake Pokemon. It spews sand from his nostrils while the enemy is blinded or burrows into the ground to hide. Shed skin. Ooh, you're weak though. Like super weak. Um I might put it in the party and then uh see if it evolves soon-ish. Cause I can't use you with your stats like that, Jesus Christ. I saw him in the bag. And Teeny's home. My lovely lady is home and brought food. Thanks, she's a keeper.
Sorry guys, just showing Teeny um the new Fox Pokemon. Where is it? There. This is a baby form. Oh my god. And this is what it turns into. <gasps> It awesome, looks like a right? French fucking connoisseur. It's based on like a th gentleman thief. <laughs> that's that's where I got the French from, the mustache. Yep. It's so cute. <laughs> I need a pen now. <laughs> Thievel and naked. So, yeah, thief. Naked? Are you kidding? It goes around stealing food and eggs. <laughs> and eggs? It erases his tracks and swipes up his tail as it takes makes off with its plunder. <laughs> My fox brother. Yep. I just need to see that. So it's called Nicket. Yep. I need to see a Nicket and a Eevee mate and see what the babies are. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I might be logging off, guys. Like I said, some of this might not be streamed, but it'll all be recorded so I can get my Pokemon reactions on camera. But since food is here, I think I'm going to take another break. Um, I think I will come back to streaming, though. I think I will. I'm not going to log off for this break, though, since it won't be, like, hours long. Going to save, though. Then we're going to take a break. I'll see you guys soon.
Okay, guys, sorry for the waits. If you guys are still here, we are back. Uh. So, right before I left, we caught us a silly cobra <laughs> who is very weak right now. Let me compare his stats again, real quick. Attack 40. For comparison's sake, his attack is 84. There's like a three level difference between them. Although I guess you've been pulling sort of late, Dottler. Yeah, uh, gonna go back and heal real quick. And then we'll actually progress through this route. <laughs> Sorry, Texan Shuckle. Okay. Let's heal up. Hopefully, Silly Cobra evolves within like two levels. Otherwise, I might have to drop him. <laughs> I love Toxtricity, he's so awesome. I'm so glad I took the investment in him. Hmm. It's looking at Titus. <laughs> All right, route six. Yamask. I swear I don't remember Yamask's uh, little thing looking like that. This isn't a Alolan, I mean, Galarian form, is it? I don't think it would be that common, but. Because it usually has a mask, right? Or maybe they just censor that, I don't know. Well, one way to find out. Let's catch it. I doubt it's a Galarian one, though. Or if that's your ground type. Wait, no. Am I asking ground type, is it? Am I tripping? Hold up. Hold up. About to find out. Yes, hold up. I swear I don't remember that, Arise. But then again, I haven't really used the Yamas much before. I've used Kofagrigus, like, competitively, but I don't remember it being ground. Um, try to find a move that won't kill it. <laughs> it can survive a pluck. I'm expecting Core Squire to evolve within the next four levels. Tomorrow definitely we'll be seeing what Sobble's final form looks like, and I can't wait. Switch our abilities. <laughs> Power trip. Commence the chucking of balls. Caught it. Oh, 
Oh, it is a Galarian form. It's so subtle. Like, I thought maybe they just had censored the human face, but no. interesting. Well, I gotta copy that down then. Mm. That should do it. It said that this Pokemon was from when an ancient clay teller was drawn to a vengeful spirit. Uh, it's also a different origin story. And the, the Galarian Yamask, huh? Like, it doesn't look that different. That's why I didn't... Uh, I might as well see what you're about. I imagine Kofagrigus looks a lot different, though. But I'm not about to, like, put you in the party. <laughs> I'll see it eventually, but I'm not like chomping at the bit to see what a Galarian Cofagrigus looks like. Sock. I love this thing so much. All right, your first real fight, Toxtricity. Nice. Even for not being very effective, that kind of hurt. Ah, oh, low sweep. I think I am going to take our centipede friend out the party. But as of right now, I don't know what I want to switch it with. I could put a bear scoot in. Or maybe even Q font. Hmm. That's normal meow. I sent the other one on a mission. Let's see. You're attacking it bad. To no surprise, you're super slow. Ooh, a 74 attack and good speed. You know what? Let's try Bear's Scooter. I like you, Senti Scorch. I'm gonna give you a break for now. Put in the bag. Ooh, Barascuda. <laughs> Physical ban, huh? No, I'll give that to you, because why not? That's it. I just cause I'm gonna use a super potion on toxicity. Yeah, let's go this way first. A camp and a TM. The heck is she doing up there? Dig. I just noticed the uh, diglet monument in the back. Careless. Oh, I didn't even think about fossils. No matter which top and bottom you can buy, they can restore it together. Combinable fossil Pokemon? What? Uh, 
Okay. I guess I just gotta find them first. I can't wait to see what these fossils are like. They're freaking combinable. Alright, let's head down. But yeah, the uh, idea of fossil Pokemon completely slipped my mind. Same with like the um, Suedo Legendary. You're saying the sunlight is harsh, but you really can't tell. Two rare bones. Scarupi. I can never remember Skarupi and Drapion's typing because it switches when it evolves. I know one's Poison Dark, but the other's Poison Bug. Actually, see a silly Cobra can do work. Because it has a super effective move. Alright, that could have hurt worse. Nice! And lowered its speed. Oh, Defiant. Ah, and it rose sharply. Freaking Defiant. Okay, we got the speed advantage, so we're good. His first victory. Guessing this is just that other path I didn't take, but we're gonna check it anyways. Oh, nope, never mind. Haven't been here. <laughs> hmm. Rare candy. from up there. It's just me remember in Gen 6 those uh, sky battles were a thing for like two battles in the entire game. <laughs> for me. Whoops. Oh, that was an accident. Misclick. I meant to use water pledge. God dang it. Oh, let's bring in Dottler. And Dottler gets switched out. Don't think you can handle a throw, unfortunately. If you would stop spamming circle throw, that would be lovely. Yeah, 
Everyone gets a turn. All right, enough of your shenanigans. Get on my nerves. Jeez, took that like a champ. Oh no, revenge. Who it could have hurt? Levels all around. Try and learn toxic, huh? Nah. <laughs> well, see if something new falls out the tree. That's not a chipmunk. Yeah, it's a chipmunk. Greedent. <laughs> like a greedy rodent. <laughs> you know what? I might as well catch you. Silly Gree, and there's nothing in your cheeks. <laughs> okay. Okay. Now I'm annoyed. <laughs> I'm annoyed now. Freaking rest. Now, get in the ball. I don't even know what Tyus is growling at, but he's growling at something. Finally. Please become something awesome, Dollar. Come on, something. Turn to Mothra. Oh. Oh my. That ain't Mothra, but I'll take it. <laughs> Well then. <laughs> or Beetle. Still bugging Psychic, the seventh spot Pokemon. It emits psychic energy to observe and save what's around it, and what's around it can include things over six miles away. I almost forgot about you. Uh, calling throughout the Galar region, this Pokemon has strong teeth and can chew through the toughest of berry shells. So Dollar turned into freaking Ore Beetle, and he looks sick now. Swarm. Still need better moves, though. Alright. Let's get that TM below us. Then we'll head up. Wing. Well, I know I'm teaching uh, Corvus Squire. Let 
am I doing? Hmm. Curious how Orbeal can learn anything new real quick. Gonna pay it back, surly it. Lame. Corvus Squire cannot learn stealing. Okay. <laughs> okay. We'll pretend like that makes sense for five seconds. What is that? Oh, it's a trap inch. I was like, what the heck? <laughs> well, since you seem to be rare, I'll catch you. Sandstorm, huh? I really like Orbeal's design, I will say. Out of all the like the regional bugs, it's probably one of my favorite designs for a final form. I forgot Trap Pinch gets really strong moves early on. <laughs> Great ball, go. And trap pinch is not ours. And Orbeetle's down. I could have switched him out. All right, Bear Scudo, time to make your debut. Even though you're gonna be fighting. Alright, Trap and Jazaris. Alright. Now we can proceed. Oh, heat more. Oh, I guess we'll catch a heat more. I want Durant's here as well. Dive on him. Get wrecked. Eh, Fury Attack should do it. Uh, I'll do one more fairy attack just to be on the safe side. Oh, of course I get a crit when I don't want one. All right, perfect. Why does everything in here have swallow? Although I guess for heat more it makes sense since he's an ant eater, but whatever. I thought I had it. Well, god dang. Well, at least it's not attacking us. I would use Nuzzle to paralyze it if it didn't kill it. One sec. And we got him. Heat more is ours. 28.
All right, now we can get out of here. Unless anything else wants to pop up that I don't know about. And a trainer. Hold up. Uh, let me uh, let me at least give Barascuda some HP before I send it to his death. Perfect. What the heck are you? <laughs> I feel like this dude personifies a part of the fan base. <laughs> uh. Jesus. Hold up, I gotta post. <laughs> I gotta post this. Uh. <laughs> Would you like to connect? Yes. I would just say LMAO. I won't call anyone out. <laughs> Alright, let's get it. <laughs> Jeez, even his ball throw. Coughing, huh? Neutralizing gas? The phone? I don't remember that Billy, but then again, I don't use coughing like that. I like coughing, it's just it kind of sucks in battle. <laughs> oh, oh my. Well, we got lucky. <laughs> I'll take that EXP. Pseudo Widow, huh? Nope, staying right in. Chose the wrong attack to switch in on. I'm impressed. Even if you are physically defensive. Ow. That hurt. Miss. Dang. Oh well, he did his job. Um, I'm trusting you, silly cobra, to get this done. I hope. Here you go first. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Pulling that weight. Oh my, <laughs> that face. Hey, we reached the town. Which means it's time to heal. It's an interesting city. Ah, it's the ghost gym, okay. Makes sense why your mask was over there. Wait, what? Fossil of an Asian Pokemon I once from the land with it like it's a mystery. Hold up. I don't know if we can just revive this thing with just the fossil we have or we need another one, but we about to find out.
Also, I think I'm gonna get Wes's face to level 30, so let's kill something random. Like a duck trio. Asshole. Ah, oh, I forgot. Side type. That hurts. Tyus, what are you doing? Hmm. A sucker punch hurts. Please don't have arena trap. Alright, doesn't have arena trap. That Duck Trio speed ain't no joke. I survived that. Impressive. I should use my own sucker punch. Asshole Duck Trio. Want to learn dig, huh? Hmm. Hmm. I'm actually thinking I'm not gonna let you get dig. Just because Bulldoze has that speed lowering, which is very useful. And Headbutt is just good raw damage. Uh. Yeah, I'm not gonna give you dig. Actually, I got that as a TM just now, so eh. If I decide to use it, whatever. Okay, let's find that professor. Okay. So I'm guessing I do need the other half. I might go farming for that other half off camera. Let's see. For now though, let's fly back into town. And if we're lucky, we could see a uh, drill. Drillizel evolved tonight, if we're lucky. <laughs> A chip pot. A quick claw. Oh, he's selling it tomorrow, I guess. You're buying a bomb mushroom. I think I had one of those, I think. <laughs> I want to wear a bronze on my head. Very interesting town. It looks like a town out of Mexico. Like, even the music sounds Mexican. <laughs> At least this part with the Spanish guitar. I see a TM. You want an impy dimp? I mean, you want a Maractus for an impy dimp? Hold up, I gotta find a Maractus. 
Oh, I can't get back up? Okay, well, that sucks. Vanna Shock. I wish it was Poison Jab, but... I'll take it. Huh. Josiah can't even learn, Brian. Good to know. Alright, I need to find a Maractus. There was Maractus down here, right? I'm not imagining things. Although I think it was more towards the front. Oh, Durant. So you were here. I won't catch you right now, though. That awkward moment where you don't know how to get down. You know what? Still the lazy thing. We're gonna fly over here. <laughs> oh, I never did get that Pokeball. Hold up. Supposedly, we're going to get something called an Impy Dimp. So, I have a fossilized fish. I'm guessing I can't combine those two? Oh? I can? She's really about to fuse these together. What is this? Dracovish? Dracovish? What the hell is that? Science was a mistake. What type of abomination is that? It makes me uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. Hold up. Shaco just got to the uh, wild area. His mighty legs are capable of running at speeds exceeding 40 miles per hour, but this Pokemon can't breathe unless it's underwater. Science was a mistake, man. What the hell is this? You don't need a nickname. And what the hell does your other form look like? Tackle are gonna protect your level ten. Strong shaw. A water dragon type. Jesus Christ. I regret my life decisions. I think I wanna add it to the party just cuz. Or beetle, taking you out for now.
Freaking Dracovish. What the hell? I guess I'll get Silly Cobra the leftovers. How is under? Oh, yes, yeah, this. Okay. I said it before, I'll say it again. Science was a mistake. Jesus Christ, what the hell was that? Actually, hold on, I think it's in my first slot. Okay, never mind, I forgot to switch. God damn it, I forget, I was going for the item originally. <laughs> I got sidetracked by the freaking uh, homunculus fish. Go away, you mask. You know, just for EXP for our new member, I'll fight. Crafty shield? Hmm? Protect the opposing team, what? Type of move is that? Also, it seems it's like one of those Pokemon that takes a while to level up, which is a pain. But what can you do? Oh, Miraculous, come here. I'm trading you. You turn. Really, you're faster? Color me impressed. Electricity. Nuzzle. Sucker punch by a cactus. One more nuzzle, then we'll start checking great balls. I actually should buy some great balls when I'm in town. Two levels for Dragovish. Nope, going straight to the box and you're getting traded. Let's fly to town. Thrust. Uh, 
Ugh, just seeing it again. Why would you make a fossil like that? Ugh. I don't understand. <laughs> it's disturbing. I can dig it everywhere. I know it'd be damn busy this way, but I know I didn't take this path yet. <clears throat> Rocky Helmet. An old favorite item of mine. It's also a very good Pokemon card in the TCG. Give me an empty dimp, sir. Yep. So long, Maractus. All right. Ooh, hello. It's a little devil. Ta <laughs> peepers. <laughs> That's cute. I like it. It's a dark and fairy type. Is that the first dark and fairy type? I can't remember. It sneaks into people's homes, stealing things and feasting on the negative energy of the frustrated occupants. <laughs> so it's like a little chupacabra. Well, not really, but. All right, Impy Dimp. Oh, metal coat. Is he as full of Scyther as in this uh, generation? Unless he got cut. Definitely understand where you say it is pretty late. Good night. Thank you for hanging out today. I appreciate it. Hope you sleep well. Okay, let's check out Ampidimp real quick. <laughs> Prankster, special attacker. Hmm. I really don't know what Dynamax level does, but. His sprite, if you'll notice, has berries tucked in his tail. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, Peepers is level 30. Hmm. Party wants to put him in the party. Not yet. Oh, yeah, hold up. Buy these great balls. What is by 10? I feel like Ultra Balls are probably a gem or two away. Oops. I think there's nothing else to explore on this side of town. It's a battle, he's got a battle. What the hell is that? And why does it look stupid? Cramorant.
Huh, it might be a water type. Interesting. Titus being a crazy dog. Okay. Uh, it's a U-turn. I'm assuming this thing is water flying. And if he's water flying. Made some perfect prey for my boy, Toxtricity. I was hoping he was faster. Does it have a f I have many questions. Why do you have a Aracuda in your mouth? What the f You just toss a fish at me? And then okay. Ooh, drill pick. Hello. Goodbye, pluck. Hmm, you have a silly cobra. Interesting how he switched up his team now. I like how Bear Scooter's cry sounds like a um, evil laugh. And get dived on. Toxel? Wait, you have a Toxel too? I mean, it's possible to get a Toxel. I mean, it's not like a one of a kind Pokemon, but still. It's even more interesting that it's not evolved yet. Yeah, he's changed around his whole team. It's interesting. Ooh, I just saw that's a double weakness. All right, reboot. You know what I just thought about? He's sore about losing, but he's lost to us this entire time. <laughs> Of course, his animation is a soccer kick, of course. 
I'm really impressed Silly Cobra is holding its own weight like this. Level ups all around. And my character's just sitting there smiling like, that's nice. <laughs> oh, her lead card. I forgot what her typing was. Fair? She might be the fairy lady. I think the only thing left to do in this town is challenge the gym. And if so, I might end the stream after there. <laughs> it would be awesome if we could get these two to evolve. Both Trizile and uh, Corva Squire. What level are they at? All right, he's practically at 35, so he might be able to. And I'm guessing you evolve at 36 too, but it's hard to know. Regardless, we're going in. Uh, I guess we should check around first. Can I, I, can I even go out here first? Really, they're not gonna stop me. No catch? And eh, of course there's a catch. Never mind. There's always a catch. <laughs> hmm. All right, let's go left. Oh, okay. So all the gyms are built on power spots. But I have to learn that from a random NPC. Huh. Interesting. All right, well, let's head to the gym. It's a ghost type gym. Let's buy some super potions actually. Just cause that last gym was actually a little challenging. I would like to switch into the fire outfit, but I might have to do it at a boutique, I guess. All right, why is he so awkward? You need to ride one of these cars to make it your way to the goal. Uh huh. I 
I'll take his control stick to the right and a couple spin to the right. Oh well, okay. Hmm, this is uh interesting. I feel like Game Freak had a lot of fun where they were thinking this up. Clink. It's very really like human ping pong. Look at that ping pong ball. Gym Trainer Clive. Pumpkaboo. Sucker punch him. Oh, okay. Made me a ghost type. It's a dirty trick. <laughs> Shadow sneak after turning me into a ghost. He's level 35 now. By the time we get out of here, I'm hoping he'll be level 36. Hmm. <laughs> Wish I had like a dedicated dark type still. But I don't feel like I need to break out Line Noon for this. Probably. Phantom. But maybe I should. I don't know, I'll think about it. Spare Cuda, Spare Scooter is pretty powerful. So, feeling confident in it. Aha, uh -huh, flinched. It's evolving now. Yes, what are you turning into? Please be amazing. Come on. Intellion. Out of all the designs that were running through my head just now, this was nowhere high on the list. I don't know how to feel about it. My little Sobble turned into this. Huh. And you're still a straight water type. The secret agent Pokemon is nicotating membranes. Let it pick out Fos' weak points so it can precisely blast them with water that shoots from its fingertips at Mach 3. Wait. Is this supposed to be like a James Bond Pokemon or something? I don't know how to feel about this. Snipe shot. It notice the effects of opposing Pokemon's moves and abilities to draw that draw in moves, allowing this move to hit the chosen target. I feel like that added effect is kinda useless, but whatever. Well, goodbye, water pledge. So, uh, okay.
Sorry, I gotta make a tweet about this. So, Antillian. Well. I don't dislike it, it's just not at all what I was expecting. All of Sobble's lines are just weird. Like from the emo phase to James Bond, like what? Thank you. Thank you. I uh, had a feeling that was going to happen. Uh, area two. I still haven't even seen Grookey's second form. Gym Trainer Lin. Huh, Corsola, huh? No! What is that? Is that a ghost Corsola? I love it. Holy crap. I want one. Yo. That's so cool. That's sick. It's literally James Bond in Pokemon form. Why is why is it so beautiful? This Corsola, look at it. It's awesome. <laughs> I think after we're done with the gym, I'll call it a stream by my so play on camera, just not on stream. Alright, this one's definitely more annoying. Hmm. Uh, uh oh. Alright. Okay, I see now, I think. Gonna have to go here first probably. Nice. Alright, let's actually switch out. Intellion. For Barascuda. I still can't get over the fact that one, Intellion is a thing. And two, that Galarian Corsola. Holy crap. That's up there with nine tails is like my favorite regional variant, like no lie. Drift blim, huh? Sounds like a job for toxicity. I have to look on the Pokédex ASAP to find out where I can get that course look, because I must have it. 
spark it up. Hey, beautiful. Don't do aftermath. Okay, I didn't use aftermath. All right, now for the gym leader. All right, I need to find that Corsola now. Cause holy crap. None, uh huh. Crabby, Corfish, Ralts. Mm hmm. That's me else. And to no surprise, you guys don't evolve. I'm wondering though, do you evolve into him or? Hmm. Might look that up. Let's see. Cutie Fly, Eevee, Applin, Spritzy, Krogunk. Yes. Look at it. It's so cool. Where are you found? Okay, you can find it back here. Only during sunshine, apparently. Hmm. All right, I gotta remember that. That's right off to the side here. I'm not joking, as soon as I'm out of this gym, I'm going after that thing. Uh, I guess I'll heal Antillion. Be on the safe side. Um, I think I'll start this, uh, um, Corvus Squire, actually. All right, one last hurrah for the stream. Goal. All right, Mr. Creepy Gym Leader, let's go. Dang, this is gem number four already. Halfway through the uh, adventure, possibly. Alistair. Those eyes. EMS, no surprise there. Hmm. Now I kind of wish I started with Antillian since you're part ground. She was drill peck though. Get him. Brutal swim. Alright, we're good. This ability switching. <laughs> Pack. Hey, level thirty five. Corsola, huh? Um, hmm. I think Curse Corsola is pure ghost, so. I might try again with the Sucker Punch combo. Even his animation coming in, that's funny. Wait, what? What the hell? So there's Corsella and Cursella? What? Are you a pre-evolution or what? 
I am confused. Okay, Cursella. Uh, oh, I was using Curse. Well, I gotta look this up in the Pokedex now, because what the heck? Nice. Barely let him get a move in. Perfect. Alright, so what's your ace? Is it gonna be Cofagrigus or what? Stupid curse. Not all the sucker punches, too, unfortunately. Oh, Mimikyu. I was not expecting it to be Mimikyu for your ace, but okay. Um. Dang, Mimikyu's part fairy. Hmm. Do I have any steel moves? I don't think so. This might just be a slugfest, and in that case, it's fine with me. I'm surprised it's Mimikyu, though, because Mimikyu is the boss Pokemon of a gem in Gen 7. It's just weird to me. Whatever. Actually, no. We're going to use Nuzzle first before we Dynamax. Oh, I forgot it has that uh, ability. This isn't going to do anything. I forgot. It can paralyze him, though. That's all that matters. That's fine. Oh, wait. He has four Pokemon. Okay, I'm stupid. I'm sitting here thinking Mimikyu is his ace. Well, haha, -ha, sucker! Hit him again. Talks Tracy thirty-five. All right, he has a Gengar as his ace. Uh, um. Alright, I trust in you, Bear Scooter, to handle this. Gengar is also an interesting choice, I guess. How lonely, how frightening. Gengar. Hmm. I'm guessing the Cursula was his, like, Super new ace, but whatever. Regardless, max darkness. Time to Dynamax. Gengar. Oh, what the hell? Okay, so Gengar is one of those unique Dynamaxes. I still don't understand what determines this. Is it just Game Freak's say so? And do these uh unique Dynamax forms even have anything special about them other than an appearance? He killed Barrascuda. Asshole. Okay, it's all good though. Still got this. I'm gonna try to take him out with one spark. 
Oh no. Okay, we ate that. We're good. Toxtricity is that dude. He survived that, though. Hey, still alive. <laughs> Even with a lower special defense. And fourth badge is ours. Ancient power, huh? Better than tackle. <laughs> Very interesting gym battle. <laughs> And we got the ghost badge. Four more to go. Pokemon to level 40. And we got Hex. All right. I'm gonna call that a stream. Thank you to everyone that might still be here. I know it's super late. Still gonna be recording though, but for those of you that came out, thank you, I'll see you later.